We're here at uh, MIPI DEFCON 2016. I uh, want to show you um, system level integration of MIPI CSI2, DeFi, and the industry first demonstration of MIPI I3C controller. The senior, can you show us the demonstration? Absolutely, Azzy. So essentially what we have here is our a CSI2 camera connected to the, our CSI2 host. And essentially the camera is capturing a five megapixel image it's sending it to our CSI host controller, uh, and we have here our DeFi test chip, silicon proven DeFi. So the host then, as it extracts the data, we have a DMA engine that it's taking that inf data into the system memory bus sitting here on this Arc development platform. At this point, we have a, some processing going on. We have the raw, so the incoming data is in raw format and the our processor is actually converting this into RGB okay. and then we are sending it out through an HDMI out. Okay. And this is what we see here in this uh, display, right? Exactly. exactly. Okay. Can you tell us a little bit about the i3C and how it operates? Absolutely. So in this demo, we actually integrated our MIPI i3C controller. So essentially, uh, as you know, the CSI2 specification defines this CCI channel, which is used for, so that the host can configure the camera. Mm -hmm. And typically, this is done with I2C. So in this case, what we're doing here, we actually we remove the I2C master, and we are using our MIPI I3C controller, and we are using it to control the camera. So we can do all kinds of things like flipping the image or enabling a specific pattern generator. Essentially, what we are showing here is the backwards compatibility of our MIPI I3C controller with legacy I2C slaves. And that allows really the I3C to be a single bus and connect to both I3C devices and I2C devices. Exactly. Okay. Can you show us a little bit how this uh, configuration happens? Absolutely. So now I will run the software driver that is controlling the MIPI I3C controller and I will request this driver to configure the camera to enable the pattern generator. So executing the command, you uh, can actually see the changes that happens in the camera. So what does the camera do right now? So the camera is uh, going, so the, the, the MIPI I3C controller is configuring a specific register in the camera that will enable the pattern generator. And then coming back to, uh, so to remove the pattern generator and have the, 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 the captured image being sent. So as you can see here, here also on the right, we have an actual I2C transaction captured. So it, this kind of represents how our MIPI I3C is absolutely compatible with I2C uh, legacy devices. So these are the two signals? SCL here and SDA here, exactly. Okay, this is a transaction, so you can see here is uh, the, our master is accessing a specific address. This is a write command, and this is the register address that is accessing, and this is the data that is actually configuring that register to enable the pattern generator. What we have seen today is a proven system level integration of MIPI CSI2 controller, MIPI D5, and uh, the industry first demonstration of MIPI I3C controller. All of them working together to have a complete uh, system level uh, CSI2 integration into your SOC. Thank you for watching.